This video is sponsored by the amazing streaming platform Acorn TV, but more about that later. This girl looks stunning in her makeup video, but wait till you see what she actually looks like. Because underneath all that makeup is this. Yes, this influencer is actually Chinese. So why is she trying to look darker? Welcome to my channel. This is Suzy aka Wakanda Queen. Right now, millions of people have already seen her strange makeup tutorial. Her fans loved it and praised her skills, but many others called it offensive and even tagged it as blackface. So are the critics overreacting about an innocent makeup video? Or was this Chinese makeup influencer definitely in the wrong? To answer that, let's look at the facts. See, the dark skin makeup tutorial was actually uploaded back in April 2020 on a Chinese site. The caption said, Can you see me? I'm the darkest in the whole network. Even then, it was received pretty well by most Chinese people. But some comments, when translated to English, had slight hints of mockery. Fast forward to more than a year later when someone reposted and called it out on TikTok, that's when it exploded and reached many people. So going back to our question, why is she trying to look darker? Well, a quick scan of her channel will tell you she's been playing with makeup to try out different characters, Avatar, Seraphine, a video game character and many more. Let's give it to her. She is actually pretty good at it. But where people had to draw the line? is when she started cosplaying cultures. She tried to be Egyptian. She tried to be Thai. She tried to be Japanese. And yes, she also tried to be Indian. Even joking once that her makeup smelled like curry. Later on, she apologized for her choice of words and said she didn't mean any offense. And most likely, she truly didn't. So, after hearing all of this, where do you stand on it? Are the critics overreacting about an innocent makeup video? Or was this Chinese makeup influencer definitely in the wrong? Because to be frank, it seems like this girl did not start this with bad intent. She was there only to do creative makeup and supposedly appreciate cultures. And given that China has banned most forms of foreign social media, while very unfortunate, it is also possible that she was only uneducated about the American history of blackface. The very disturbing part of history where white actors in the late 19th century would use black grease paint on their faces to portray free black people and plantation slaves on stage. And no, the representation was not meant to flatter, it was meant to mock and ridicule people of color. And so, having all of this in mind, Nightfam, for the last time I want to ask you, are the critics overreacting about an innocent makeup video or was this Chinese makeup influencer definitely in the wrong? And now a word from our sponsor. Okay guys, this is worth your time, I promise. Remember earlier I told you about this streaming platform, Acorn TV? Well, look at this! She hasn't moved from the seat the whole day, what the hell are you doing? Stop it! <laughs> you wouldn't be laughing if you get thousands of hours of commercial free shows for $5.99 per month. So many hidden gems I never even heard of. What is up with the British accent? <laughs> okay, okay. I'm super addicted to this Acorn TV exclusive show called The Other One. It's a British comedy about two sisters from totally different worlds who didn't even know each other existed until their father just dropped dead. And if you're a Downton Abbey fan, there is a super hilarious performance on this show <laughs> by your favorite Siobhan Finneran. Uh, Sonia uses it on her iPhone. I use it on my Android phone. And it's also available on Amazon. On Fire TV, Google Chromecast, and Roku. You can also join us and escape to Britain and beyond Britain. without leaving your seats. I'm so excited for the season finale of Dalglish next week and also the Madame Blanc mysteries. Ooh. Visit acorn.tv and use code Project Nightfall to get 30 days free access. You can thank me later. Thank her.